this is Jill with Crick Flicks, and I am finishing up an order here for Edith. Um, Edith, I will send you a link directly so you can see your girls before they go out the door. Um, it is for five 18 inch princesses, and I'm going to kind of, I, I left one a few of them completely undone. I'm going to start the one from scratch. Um, this is the little girl I did. Um, Edith, you had set a, a lighter. The image that you had sent me, there's African American and there's a couple skin tones. And this was the lighter that you asked for. And she, her hair is more brown, dark brown versus black. Um, but that that's the hair on the lighter skin tone. Um, which I believe when I put the hair on, it's really, really dark brown anyway. And she had the tiara on with the rhinestones in it and pearls and done the pink and then the little pink slippers. So the first thing that I'm going to do is I have these ropes that I get at, um, these are actually from Hobby Lobby and they're made by the Paper Studio. That's Hobby Lobby's brand, and I believe they have a sale going on right now, 50% off. My daughter and I are going to go tomorrow. Uh, I need nothing. However, when it's 50% off, all of a sudden you find your needs. I, I find something I need. So if I do, not making any promises, but if I do run into some really good deals, I will do a haul and show you what I got and what there is. But um, just to let you know, Michael's is 50% off of every, I think everything my daughter said, or it might be just Christmas. I think probably just Christmas. I don't know, but it's coming to that time of the year that um, Black Fridays are becoming Mondays, Tuesdays, Wednesdays, and Thursdays as well. There's no day of rest. Um, I'm going to line the tiara up with these gems on the bottom of it. I didn't do the whole thing because, of course, I can't go around all of these curves. Yeah, I only left one to do. I'm sitting there thinking, I ran out of these. I thought I had a whole bunch. I did, but I got 10 with front and back, so this is the 10th one. Okay, I put that on there across the bottom of the tiara. And then I've got some stones, and I know I did my haul well, a week or two ago, and I said I never have the right size stones, and they had these for a dollar a packet or some super cheap, and I'm kicking myself. You have no idea how bad I'm kicking myself because I should have bought more, and I didn't. I don't know, I, I don't know why. Um, it had the light purple, the dark purple, and the pink. And what I did is I just mixed it up on whatever stones I could fit inside here. Some of them had the heart. They didn't, they weren't all the same. And that's just, that's one of the reasons I say that when I, when I make something, no two are, are ever identical. And that's the reason why is because you, you use what you have. And if you spend your time running and picking up every time you have an order, you want to do, um, do everything exactly the same, you're gonna spend more time in the store than you are on working. I'm gonna check real quick and see if I have any more hot pink or pink gems. She's the last one and I'm running out of the stones. So let me grab my stone bag here and guess what? I have some more. No, something flew down behind me. Oh my mat cover. I, I got a mess going on, guys. I'm working on four orders at once. Um, that is not for crafting. That's my headband. Okay, I do have some more pink here. I can use the four little ones. I want to see if I have... Here's some more pink here. Um, either, just so you know, they're all going to be the same, yet they're all going to be different. Um, you had said that you wanted me to really bling them up and um, and make them different. You were asking for making the skirts a little bit different. Uh, any way that I could change it up and just make them all their own individual baby. And that is what I'm doing. So I'm gonna move my little box of trinkets. I have another box of trinkets here. What do I have in here, guys? I think I only have Ooh, these, but they're too heavy to use on her crown. We're going to come back to that. I think that's something that's going to go on there. Um, 
okay, I, what I'm looking for are the stones, the way that I did them. There's a trio, a cluster of three rhinestones, pink ones here. Mine I did are, are going to be a little bit different um, because I'm using whatever I have left. So I'm going to do a dark pink on there and I found my tweezers guys, both pairs that I lost. I lost two and I kept complaining and complaining because I, I couldn't find them at the store. Every time I went to the store they didn't have them. And I don't know what I was digging through. And I found my, well, I'll finish about my um, tweezers. I found them, but I don't remember where. And in some, some project I was working on for both pairs, they were in a box of that project. Um, and I was also gonna tell you that I didn't want all three of the dark ones on here because I was alternating with the light ones. So we're gonna take a light one off of here, or dark one off of here, and move it over here. And we're gonna use a dark one here, 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 nope, here. Because there's two, 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 and then we've got the light pink to finish that little trio off. Um, I'd lost my mother's necklace, my grandmother's necklace, this one. And um, I mentioned over and over and over again, I go to Hobby Lobby, I go to Michael, I go to Joanne's Fabrics, and I go out to eat. That's all, oh, and I go to my kid's house. That's about the extent of my travels. And so when something's misplaced, those are the places they're gonna be. My coffee mugs, I've left them in every store, including pennies last year. So. But I, I take a coffee mug in with me and my husband gets so mad because he always says, can't you just go 10 minutes shopping without a mug? So I, I don't do that anymore, I try. And I don't take my coffee mug in because I lose them and the kind that I use aren't cheap. Um, they keep my coffee hot for hours because I lose my coffee all the time too. It's rather comical, but what's even more comical is my, my daughter who picked on me all the time is exactly like me. But anyway, I found my necklace and it was inside it wasn't in the wash it was inside where we put the dirty clothes um i think that's where i found it wrapped up no it wasn't it was in a diaper bag or something someplace again that i wouldn't look but i found it um uh, the the little ring that they put on to hold this on was not soldered shut and we keep clamping it and i said forget it i'm going to put it on the hoop that it's actually wrapped on Anyway, I hung them up different because I didn't want to lose it again. Um, but I have a feeling that in 20, 2020, guys, I have a feeling I'm going to be getting more stones. I'm, really, I, I'm betting, I'm betting, and if anybody wants to take a bet with me, I'm betting that Jen and Kiki, I'm going to say, my daughter-in-laws, I bet you both of them have babies next year. I'm just... I, 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 I think that's going to be my next new news to everybody. No, they're not pregnant, but I think that's going to be common. Those of you that watch me have probably seen me ever since Kendall was born. And if, if I get two more in this upcoming year, that would make 14. Unbelievable. I know they're both trying, so that's why I say that I'm going to have new grandkids. Kiki wants to have children very, very quickly because her and Adam have been get together for years and I know they just got married. However, they want their kids to be the same age. <clears throat> so when they go to school with all their cousins, they're all in the same age bracket, which if Jen and Kiki had them this next year, they'd be the same age. And even the boys, uh, because my granddaughter who is six, who's a month, two, two, three months gestationally, she's the same age. No, gestationally, she's three months younger. She was born three months early, or he, he was born three months early. Um, so him and Isabel, who are absolute best friends, and, and so I don't care what gender um, they are, like, you know, saying, oh, wouldn't it be nice to have two little girls? Say, it doesn't make any difference. Those two are inseparable. Actually, they've been <laughs> getting in trouble at school. Um, they're in first grade? No, let's see, they're sixth. They must be in first grade. I can't, I took Isabel to school every day last year for kindergarten, so I'm trying to guess what grade she's in. Um, I put the glitter, silver glitter, inside to finish off the tiara. 
I'm trying to look for some good light. Okay, I'm gonna put the gloss in her eyes. Um, anyway, I just thought I'd share that little note. I think I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna have more grandbabies. I tell you, they are so awesome. I had, how many did I have over today? I take care of Mila every day and I have Veda and Lane on Fridays and I do play dates whenever possible with Amy and her two three-year-old and five-month-old. So she was over this morning and now that it's getting to be the holidays, um, all of my kids, my Kiki, had said, you guys are crazy. You decorate for Christmas in October. And they're the ones that just bought the brand new, not brand new, just bought a new house. Um, but it's like mammoth. I think it's 3,500 square feet or 1,000, 4,000. I can't remember what it is on an acre lot. And um, it has this, this um, what's it called? Uh, I can't even think what it's called. But anyway, it, the, the open staircase that wraps all the way around the upstairs. And Kiki kept talking about, oh my God, I can't wait to decorate for Christmas this staircase with garland, 72 feet of garland. She said, I just can't wait. And all lit up in red bows and everything. So she had us over, they had us over for dinner last night. And not only did she decorate her staircase, her entire house is done, except for her tree. She got, she went and bought, or they went and bought a six foot tree and decided because they're, it's it's vaulted ceilings with a loft that overlooks, that's what it was, a loft. That was, that was the word I was looking for. And Kiki said, no, 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 uh, that this tree's big enough. So they put the tree in the front window and it's not tall enough. So they're gonna go back to get a 10 foot tree to put in there. They're gonna move the six foot tree into their fir first level family room. They've got a lower level uh, walkout family room. And she's putting a another six foot tree in their bedroom because their bedroom has a fireplace and a pat patio walkout. It's upstairs on the second floor, but the patio, you stand out there. And the other day there was deer in the cornfield behind them. And, um, so she wants to put up another uh, seven foot tree, six or six foot tree in her bedroom. And I said, well, would, would you, you are you talking a tall, thin one? You know, like in the corner on the other side of the fireplace or whatever? And she said, no, a big fat one, just like the one downstairs. I said, oh my gosh, you know how many ornaments it was, it's gonna take? But um, I had mentioned in some of my other videos why I, at Christmas, the the families, the adults get from us how, uh, holiday decorations, any holiday, whatever I collect, that's what they get because they like to decorate as much as I do and they all have big houses so it takes a lot. It takes a lot but when I saw her all decorated I, and I knew what I'd gotten her for Christmas I thought I said are you gonna have any more room for any more decorations I mean you got them everywhere and she said oh I've got plenty of room and I was so glad she said that because um, I always have all these sales this stuff just goes on sale for so dirt cheap and I start shopping I do some shopping right after Christmas and I put it away when that stuff is 80% off and then I do it whenever they start to put it in the stores and put the very first sale they have, especially if it's something new that's come out. Like I've started an elf collection for all of my kids. I have an elf collection, they want to take it from me. So I decided I start all of them with the, the elves. So one day maybe at the end of my video I'll put pictures up of uh reminds me of home alone <laughs> but I love decorations for all holidays including Easter I even have a tree up for Easter I just love to decorate and my house is not big I do not have the room to put in the stuff that they have the room for so when I decorate you I can't have anybody over because there's no room for them to sit walk stand Pretty much, I'm 
I'm a little eccentric in a lot of ways, guys. But that makes me who I am. And you either love me or you hate me. Okay, the, ooh! Edith, you asked for the brown curly hair. The other option that I had was the wire, um, which was this one. You know what? It doesn't matter if they're all different. It doesn't matter. Guess what I'm going to do? I think I'm going to do one of them in the, in the wire. Oh, but I can't do that until I make sure I have these matched up. And in the background you hear cutting is I'm working, like I said, on four different orders at once. And I do believe the vast majority of you can hear over my machine running. And I'm kind of doing both at the same time because I have to get all of this stuff done by Sunday. So, um, I... I'm sorry if you have to listen to my machine on top of having to listen to me jabber, but there is that button that quick says go forward or switch or stop or whatever. Um, if you need to, go for it because I've got to do what i got to do. And I'm going to grab another one. I've got like 40 sheets printed out here that i got to cut because... I'm going to be up. Oh my God. I can't believe it. I'm going to be glittering. I'm sure. Right straight through the night. I'm going to have a long weekend, guys. I can't get as much done during the week because I have my granddaughter. So nights and weekends are my... I'm riding over the protective cover of my mat. I got stuff all over the floor, guys. If you could only see the mess I have going on. And I hate it because I, I don't, um, I can't work as well when I'm this crowded. But, this is what it is. Okay, now for this, my mouth is starting to get dry. So I need to get something to build me up some saliva. Okay. I'm gonna put a little bit more on her. This is, this is, there's two different kind of hair you can use. Both of them, this one you can find in, in Joanne Fabric, you find it anywhere. I don't have any problems finding this hair. It's a little harder to work with. I prefer it. I like this one better. I think it's more natural looking. Um, and I, I pull it to get it kind of fluffed out so that it's not so, and then when I just ball it up, it looks fluffy and curly. Um, and I do like it better than the other hair, the hairs that you have available. The only thing is, is it's, it's a little bit more time consuming. And when you're gluing it down, you have to mess with it a little bit because if you don't really get it pushed down really, really good, it doesn't, it doesn't stick. This one's so tight together when you, when the, the one on the wire, that you just ball it up, put it on there, and that's it. This one is, is a lot messier and harder to work with, but I like it better. I don't know why, I just, I like it better. I'm trying to get the, the stuff off my nails. And I'm not gonna use this one, I'm gonna put it back in, get it all wound up like a snake and stuck in here. The reason I'm always picking the glue off my nails is it makes it really hard for me to work with things like this because they get stuck to my fingernails. Okay, she's got her hair. She's got her hair. She's got her hair. She's got her hair. She does not. She does not. She does not. She does not. These guys all got their tiaras done, but not their hair. So, I am not going to subject you to watching me put the hair on all of these. I am going to pause and come back and show you what I'm gonna do after I get all the hair, like the hit, the tear on the hair on there. When I take pictures, you'll see better. But I'm gonna go ahead and pause if my battery isn't all the way shot or stopped on this, and then I will come back. It's not linking up very good, so I'm afraid. Okay, thanks a lot, and I'll be back. <laughs> 